tragic loss for Southwest Washington and the Gallaudet University community. Retired Professor Frances Parsons has died. Parsons was hit by a car while walking her dog outside her home on Wednesday. We went there today and found lots of people all praising her. Tom Rousey is live in the newsroom with more on Parsons' legacy. Tom? And Morris, they say they will always remember her with fondness. She taught many in her community how to do basic sign language. They say she often had a smile on her face and she will be greatly missed. Oh, Francis was a wonderful person. Francis Peggy Parsons spent the last 20 years of her life at Southwest DC's Town Square Towers. Very, very well loved in the building. And it, it's sad for all of us. General Manager Barbara Barton says yesterday afternoon residents were getting ready for a holiday party. A gentleman came and said someone is lying in the driveway. Police say Parsons was walking with her dog on this ramp that leads to the building's parking garage. A man driving a Porsche Cayenne S was heading out when he hit Parsons. She was taken to the hospital where she died. You know, it's a terrible tragedies, especially around the holidays like this. Parsons lived an incredible life. Declared deaf at five, she'd never let the disability stop her, traveling all over the world. These pictures show her talking at a Virginia Association of the Deaf event after she'd gone to Antarctica at age 80. She worked at Gallaudet University for a quarter century, some of that as an art history professor. She even wrote a number of books. To think about how many other obstacles she had conquered over her life. She's 90 and dies this, this way. It's, it's terrible. Valerie Cash loved both Parsons and her dog Wombat, who was not hurt when the car hit Parsons. She was her hearing dog, so if someone would you know, ring the doorbell or knock on the door, Wombat would jump up and down. Cash says it's hard to believe her neighbor is gone. I'm going to miss her very much. As for the man who was driving the Porsche, at this point at least, he has not been charged, but D.C. police say this is still under investigation. I'm told by someone in the building he was very, very distraught after this happened. Live in the newsroom tonight, I'm Tom Rousey, News Channel 8.